friends. I'm so glad to see you all again. We have a very special story today, but before we get started, I have a question. Who's got it? That's right, God's got it. Whenever I ask the question, who's got it? I want you to say, God's got it. So, who's got it? That's right, God's got it. Good job, friends. Our very special story today, we're gonna do very soon, but we're gonna learn our memory verse first, and it goes like this. God is with you wherever you go. And that's Joshua 1, 9. Can you do that with me, friends? God is with you wherever you go. Let's do it one more time together, friends. God is with you wherever you go. Good job, friends. Our true Bible story begins in the desert today. Have you ever been in a desert? Do you know how hot it is in the desert? Really hot in the desert, right? Like over 100 degrees. Let's fan ourselves and cool ourselves down because it's so hot in the desert. Good job, friends. Like I said, today's Bible story takes place in a very hot desert. And there was a mother named Hagar and her son. And they were very tired and very hot. Now, tell me, what do people need when they're very tired and very hot? Do they need a warm coat? No. Do they need some roller skates? No. Do they need some water? Yes, they need water. They needed water so bad, but Hagar and her son did not have a drop of water. They were out, and Hagar did not know what to do. She put her son under a tree, and then she walked somewhere else and sat. And they were just so, they're just too tired and too hot and too thirsty to walk around anymore. And that's when Hagar began to cry. And then Hagar's son cried too. They were both crying. Hagar and her son were all alone in the desert. They were tired, thirsty, and hot. They thought no one could hear them crying, but somebody did hear them. Do you know who always hears us? That's right, God heard us, and God heard them. And Hagar and her son cried, and an angel spoke to Hagar and told her to not be afraid. God had heard her son's cry, and he showed her where to find water. God showed Hagar where to take her son to get some cool, refreshing, and much needed water. That is so awesome. No matter where we go, God is with us. And we don't have to worry because God's got it. Who's got it, friends? That's right, God's got it. Great job today, friends. That was such a special story. Before we go, let's bow our heads and pray. Open them, close them. Open them, close them. Give a little clap. Open them, close them, open them, close them, fold them in your lap. Dear God, it makes me feel so good to know that you are always with me and all my friends here today. No matter where we go, you hear us and you take care of us. We love you, God. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks for listening, friends. We'll see you next week. Bye-bye.